The mayor had some help untying the Miley Lay at a blessing ceremony held for the newly renovated Mother Waldron Park in Kaka'ako. Developer Stanford Carr used some leftover money from his nearby affordable rental development project to make improvements to the park. We were fortunate to bring the project in under budget, ahead of schedule, so we had some unencumbered contingency funds that we needed to utilize within a certain time frame or it would have lapsed. And so what better investment than in our community park here, which is adjacent to our project, so it only not only benefits our residents, but the greater Kakako community. The developer added a new basketball court, playground, and new landscaping for about $600,000. The almost two-acre park is surrounded by newly developed and yet-to-be-built affordable housing. The families who live there can come here and play, play basketball, sit in the park, relax and rest. But if you look around us today, you see other examples of affordable projects. Over here, Diamond Head is an affordable project. Behind us here is an affordable project, low rise affordable. This is a community that is becoming truly more affordable and a place for all of us to gather. This is a truly wonderful uh, project and really just shows uh, what we can do when we work together with the city, the state, and the uh, private sector and it really benefits everybody in the communities. For condo communities, there is nothing more valuable than a public park. And so we are very thankful for um, Sanford's efforts as well as Department of Parks and Recreation because as you look around you, the fact that this is all green is really a joy. Mother Waldron Park opened in 1937 and is named after Margaret Waldron, who is known as a patron saint of Kaka'ako. She spent much of her time helping the children in the community.